Cystic prostatectomies are often received partially fixed. Ideally, they should be received fresh and inflated with formalin via a catheter, otherwise open anteriorly and allow to fix. After fixation, measure the prostate and bladder and open AP to the bladder level of the bladder neck. Then look for the ureters. These are above and natural to the tip of the semal vesicles. Take off the ureteric resection margins, open the clips and place in the cassette. Sometimes they are attracted and can't be found. The bladder in this case has a large median lobe of the prostate but no obvious tumour. Ink the left side green, the right side black. Spray with Bowen's solution to fix the ink, ink to the prostate. And then wash with water and dry. Remove the prostate from the bladder and bisect the bladder into left and right sides. Then take parallel sections up the bladder to the level of the dome and take a perpendicular section of the dome. Then slice the cerosal fat looking for lymph nodes. Here is the uracal remnant, a fibrous strip. Extensively sample the, the bladder, including the ureteric orifice. Here is the ureteric orifice on the other side and the ureter can now be identified. This is removed and placed in a cassette with the tube label. Extensively sample a bladder which has no obvious tumour, especially areas of ulceration and flattening of the mucosa. Next move to the prostate. Remove the urethral resection margin, put cut side down and dictate this. Then slice the prostate. Sometimes paper can be used to X for extra traction. Embed the whole prostate 